Hi, this video accompanies the blog post on ClickView, nPrinting and Google Drive where we look at um, creating a solution for pushing extracts from ClickView to a number of users via uh, the cloud and in this case we're using Google Drive. Um, this video is just a, a quick example of it working. So I'm going to open a, a file that I prepared previously and in here we can see that we have uh, a reduced task which is picking up um, our connected ClickView document uh, and we see here it's sending to Google Drive so we've set up a task here which is doing the reduce we've, uh, we're sending the output to our sync drive which is at present you can see here completely empty and we have a number of um, recipients set up and each of those recipients they have their own subfolder and if we drill into the recipients we can see that it, we specified the subfolder here and each of them also has a filter so um, John's filter is sending him just the data for the UK and there are similar filters set on all our other recipients So we have the reduced data task which is then going to push out a subset QVW for each user and we also have a report task set up which is sending a PowerPoint report and that's set up in much the same way where we're outputting to our Google Drive, we're picking up a template report and we're sending to each of the recipients. So on top of that we also built um, a job which pulls those two tasks together and a schedule so this is set, set up to run at a beat um, so these things are pushed out automatically um, we can also kick it off manually so that's it going there and you see clip view popping up in in the front as it works through that push that out of the way and we can see straight away here we've got folders being created in our Google Drive sync folder now because this is using Google Drive desktop Anything which goes on here, you can see the QVW file appearing here for George, is also going on in our sync folder on Google Drive on, on the web. So at present we've got the three folders, I uh, should expect the next one to appear now, here it is. And um, within each of those folders the um, files are being created. So we've got the QVW file there already, uh, I expect the PowerPoint file to appear shortly. But what we can do for each of these folders, we can set up um, sharing. So we select here to share. And this is the Ringo folder. So we're going to um, allow Ringo at quickintelligence.co.uk to be able to edit um, this folder. And we're going to send him a quick message. Share and save that. And we're going to allow that. We, we know who Ringo is, so we're happy that that goes out and done. So Ringo will be receiving an email, and uh, that will tell him that um, there will be files available for him. Uh, hopefully, M printing yep, has now finished all of those tasks. So in each of the folders that have been created, we have the subset QVW and the PowerPoint file and for each of those they also exist in Google Drive as the schedule runs each day or more frequently if you wish it will um, update those files the users can then download and use those as they wish Many thanks for, for watching this video. I hope you take a look at the blog post as well where we give more instructions on how to set up and configure this. Thank you for watching.